Hello, beautiful humans. I'm here today to go over some coping strategies that I'm using for myself to get through the challenge of times of being home and being without our friends and our family members and being part of the school community. So one of the things that I do is I love to read and this book is called The Science of Happiness. And one of the chapters in here is about smiling, which right now, even thinking about smiling, you're like, oh my goodness, please. But actually smiling does help. If you smile, and this is, I do this with my students, and they're always like, Miss Kay, that's so weird, but it works. So if you get your phone and you set the timer for 20 seconds, because scientifically, 20 seconds is what exactly what you need to trick your brain to think you're happy, which sometimes when we're in hard situations, we have to trick our brain to think we're happy. So right now, I challenge you at home, 20 seconds and a full smile like the kind of smile that it's kind of uncomfortable because your brain's thinking, what's happening? Why is this person smiling so hard? Why is this person doing all these things? So you have to think about how these 20 seconds go by and what you're going to do. Okay, 20 seconds. It seems like a long time when you're doing it. I challenge you to FaceTime someone and have them do 20 seconds. Challenge someone in your family to do it and you can see. And for me, sometimes I do this several times a day because I'll be having a moment where I'm frustrated or sad or just mad at the situation. So I'll say, okay, 20 seconds, give it, set the timer. So those are things, that's one of my coping strategies that I use daily to get through this time and this time will pass, I promise you. Clay leads the way. You may be home, but you're not alone. We're in this together, we support you.